Uh, mm. We need to get to Kano State to take update from <laughs> our correspondent, Ibrahim mm. Issa, who is standing by. Um, Ibra Ibrahim, we know that Kano State is one of the states where, you know, it, it has now been dubbed a battleground state. Talk to us about where you are and what is playing out there. Well, currently I'm standing at uh, Sabongori East, uh, one of the polling units at Tagi local government areas. Voting is currently on. But as you see behind me, the electoral officers are anticipating the voters to come and vote because uh, voting started early. Distribution of material started early. We were at uh, Kano Municipal earlier in the morning. Around, at around 8 a.m., the sensitive materials were being distributed by INEC officials. There is also presence of security personnel at almost entry and exit points of the state and on major roads. So currently, as we speak, voting is ongoing at most parts of uh, Kano State. Uh, uh, the situation you can see here is almost similar, uh, uh, is almost similar to what you can actually uh, witness in most parts of the state. The two major candidates in the election have voted. We were there with them, and then uh, where they voted, there is uh, peace. And, uh, you know, there is uh, little or no challenge so far uh, witness in the state based, based on the places we've gone to and uh, currently where we are, as you can see, electoral officials are waiting for, 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 for voters to come and cast their ballot. That is to say there is a uh, voter apathy, so to say, probably uh, uh, the, the uh, local observers and some who had the chance to speak to are telling us it's, uh, it may be as a result of the fallout uh, during the presidential elections. That is currently the situation in Kano State. Ibrahim, I was going to ask you earlier about those who were, because we have a lot of people sitting, sitting down there. Um, are, they, are they the electoral officials who are waiting for people to come and cast their ballots, or are those voters who have already voted? Yes, Fred, currently what you can see behind me are uh, electoral officials and as well party agents. These are, these are the people you can, you can see seated. And in, in some places, they are all waiting for the electorate to come and cast their ballot. And as we speak, the, you, you, can, you can get the sound of uh, air surveillance. The security operatives are currently having an air surveillance uh, to ensure that the election is, is peaceful. And you know, yesterday we, we, we got to know that uh, the Nigeria police had deployed an uh, air wing whereby there will be air surveillance to ensure that the election is uh, heat free. So the feed you are seeing now is uh, party agents as well as electoral uh, office, uh, officials are actually anticipating voters from this uh, polling unit talking about Sag Sabangri East to come and cast their ballots. This is almost similar to uh, some areas where we've been to today. And Ibrahim, so far in this particular polling unit you are now, can you give, uh, if, not, if not by number, but just give, give us a general idea of what the voter turnout has, has been like? The, there has been a low turnout of voters, probably because INEC officials had distributed the voting materials as early as eight. We've been to many parts of the metropolis and we saw INEC officials distributing the materials and voting started as early as eight in most places that we've been to. Probably that is the reason why uh, the, 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 the visuals you are seeing now, probably that's the reason why there is, uh, the, the electoral officials are waiting for more people to come and cast their ballot, they, they, they must have casted, uh, they must have cast their ballot earlier enough. That is the reason why uh, you are seeing them seated, anticipating more voters to come and cast their ballot. You can see uh, women, you can see youth, you can see uh, uh, those who had already voted are waiting for the moment whereby counting would commence. They are waiting to witness how the counting would commence. So that is currently the situation at Fogi local government talking about Sabongari East. And Ibrahim, when you listen to the, the conversation around you, 
and then just even from those who have voted already. Does it seem like more people are going to turn out? Is this a general state of voter apathy or that people are just being, uh, people are watching out for how things will play out? Well, in, in, in most polling units, you know, the, there are more polling units. There are more voting points. So the numbers, the registered voters at most of those polling units uh, have reduced. So probably, for example, if a polling unit has about 15 uh, ant anticipated voters and those 15 people come in at once as early as 8 to vote, the INEC officials would actually wait for counting uh, um, time to to actually come. Probably that's the reason why most polling units, uh, probably that's the reason why in most polling units you see election of issues uh, uh, anticipating people to come. It is actually difficult to say that uh, from this point more people will come and cast their ballots. Rahim, we are about an hour for 40 minutes to when um, that queue will, will close, if, if I can say that, because by 2.30, only those who are on the queue will be allowed to vote. We'll see what happens between now and then. Our correspondent, Ibrahim, is live for us in Kano.